all right well it's been raining for the last couple of days here at my dad's it's got water sitting there i figured it was going to sit over here by the road um i've been meaning to get up here at the skid loader and grade that off or grade it off the excavator but the bigger problem i've got we have a pond back there where we're digging the pond that water's not draining out so i actually just came by to adjust the speed of the thumb because i had to bring a little screwdriver but since i've got it running i think i'm gonna track back there it's gonna make a mess but it is what it is i'm gonna track back here and i'm gonna get that to drain out to that ditch so let's go do that let's get you guys in the machine i'll get walking back here and we'll see what we can get done to drain that out and then i need to uh i need to grease this track next time i come up here uh, all right i wonder if we have a good log and we've got a bunch of logs here but do we have a good one and you know what i'm gonna do with it you know if you don't know you don't watch my videos enough um i don't know there's not bad can i reach that That's just outside of my reach. Right there. Say, I thought I thought it was just a little too far. What's that one there? Let's grab that one. That uh, thumb's a little quicker. I need to read my uh, I need to read my manual on my thumb. I don't remember. Uh, I don't remember. I think it's opposite of what you think it would be. water sitting there now this pond ought to do pretty good when dad gets it in oh yeah water's draining I just don't like it sitting there that much I mean it may be because that area is pretty flat we'll see when we get back here see I wish this machine I mean it's cold I wish this machine would uh, track a little quicker. Yeah, I see the water moving because I see, I see, you know, bubbles in the water and stuff. Oh, it's running out of there pretty good. I might just be wasting my time. And getting the machine all nasty. Oh yeah, it's a lot of water rushing into there. Holy cow back here and see look at that water rushing in right there wow that is a lot of water in there wow that is a whole lot of water whole lot of water holy cow i can't believe there's that much water coming down off that hill wow hopefully you guys can see that like right there Is that water running in there my goodness whole whole lot of water wow wow I mean I I knew there was a, a good amount of water I just didn't know it was anything like that it's just running right down out of that field all right let's see if we've got a bottom 
bottom in this because this is where we filled the other day. Make sure the track doesn't drop. And this is where I love these wide tracks. That's why I wanted I wanted a 24 inch wide track machine. Because I like doing pond work, I like doing tree work, stuff like that. So you gotta be able to get into the into the wet. Alright, let's see if we can make this a little better. Just a little better. Sure we can. selection up here you saw my selection you can see then when I do that I mean I guess we can do that it usually rolls up in the bucket I don't want to do that let's get it back where we're headed stuff out. Minor tweaks to my grade beam. the other day I couldn't grade it it was just it was entirely too wet so I left it a little rough and I figured it would dry up enough the next time I got out here and then they decided to to give us a bunch of rain in the forecast and I mean it's not good for anything but Wider. Get 
some of this water that's sitting right here. That's pretty hard stuff.
it's running that way now. All this water's running that way. This water's running that way. Every, everybody's running that way except for the, the sinkhole. I mean, that's where the dump trucks were going, and they were just pounding it and pounding it. But anyways, that ought to be good. I mean, I guess I could go out there at that log and smear it all around, but I'm not that worried about it. Looks like everything's running that way, but I'd say, uh, I'd say the pond have a pretty good job of filling up. I mean, look at that water run through there. Can you guys see that? Let me see. Yeah, you guys see that. It's hard to tell where I got the camera. Yep. You guys see that? That's, that's a good amount of water. And like I said, you can tell it's just... It's everything that runs off all these fields all around here that comes down here. It all just collected in this lower spot. I mean, this is where he's got the flags, flags sitting. That's going to be the pond. So you can tell the water's coming from right there. There's, I don't know, three or four little rivers coming from there. I mean, a lot of it comes from back there. And then obviously when we cut this dike down, that the other side of this, this side of the dike, like here's the breach so then this side of the dike from about here on it all falls this way and then it kind of shifts and the ground falls that way to the creek because this all flows to a creek that goes right through the breach so anyways well there was a quick little video of getting water to come out of here i might uh i might grab this log again and i might just i might clean up some of that I might pull it this way maybe get rid of this low spot I don't want to uh
tracking out through where I did, just did more harm than good, but have a good one and uh, as always hopefully we'll see you tomorrow all right talk to you later thanks for watching short little video but thanks for watching